This is He Knows His Sport, bringing you that heat and that fire. This is the health video for today. Three day fast, no meat. I'm going to say that again. Three days fast, no meat. It's imperative every three months to go three days without eating no meat. Am I sitting here saying don't eat no meat at all? No, but do that once every three months. Why? These are the three reasons. The biggest and most important reason is it reduces inflammation immediately. I'm going to say that again. It reduces inflammation immediately. You'll start to feel reap the benefits after 24 hours. You'll see how light on your feet you feel after 72 hours. So my advice to you guys, every three months for three days, go on a no meat fast. Because that's a natural way to reduce inflammation. Inflammation is the number one thing in the body that can cause diseases and cancers. They thrive when the body's inflamed. What does inflammation mean? It means that your blood vessels, your arteries, your veins are working extremely hard. They are tense. They're basically stressed. And when they're tense and stressed like that, it causes your blood pressure to uptake, rise, surge. It also causes stress on your heart, unwanted and unneeded stress. So meat, when you consume it all of the time and you don't take a break from it, it can keep your inflammation levels high. Yes. Do some research on that. Study to show yourself approval. This is why once every three months, you want to do a three day fast from meat eating. Number two, meats, especially those cured and processed meats, they can create cancer cells and they can form diseases in the body. This is why you want to stay away from processed meats. If you eat meats, make sure they are organic. Make sure they are pasture raised. Make sure that they have marked, got all of the marks and checkers. They are organic. You got to make sure these things. You can't be eating grade F meat. If you're going to eat meat, that shit needs to be grade A++++. I'm going to say that again. You cannot eat grade F meat. If you're going to eat meat, it needs to be grade A++++. Why? Because you are what you eat. And what you put into your body is imperative. This is why it's important that what you put into your body is organic meat. vegetarian fed meat meat that has eaten nothing but a vegetarian diet throughout its life meat that was not suffocated meat that wasn't stressed because you are what you eat and if that meat is stressed you will be stressed in your body yes that meat needs to check all those markers. Do y'all research, man. Study to show yourself approval. And the third thing, meat puts on weight. If you're trying to lose weight and that is your goal, you need to abstain from it once every three months for three days. You will be light on your feet. That's what people don't understand. Meat is very hard for the body to digest. The body does a lot of work when it has to digest food. Meat is one of them on the top of the list. So when you abstain from meat for a few days, not only are you helping the environment because you're not consuming meat, but you're also helping your insides. Because for those three days, once every three months, your body is thanking you because it does not have to work as hard to digest one of the hardest digesting foods. It takes five to six hours for meat to be digested. That's right, five to six hours. This is why I don't understand why people are eating once every two to three hours. That makes no sense. You haven't fully digested, but you're still eating. Y'all gotta learn the importance of fasting, man. And y'all gotta learn the importance of fasting from meat. Three days, for three days, once every three months. It's beneficial for the health. Fasting has so many holistic benefits. 
it reverses the aging process or damn near slow that thing down to the crawl. Fasting is beneficial because it cleanses the body, it rids it. It's a natural detoxifier and a natural cleanser like nobody's business. It's the best on the planet. Better than anything else you can do. So that's what I implore you meat eaters to do. Fast once every three months for three days from meat. And I'll come out with another health video later today to explain the different types of proteins that you can eat to replace the meat intake for those three days that you are fasting because there's going to be a withdrawal effect. But you can make that withdrawal effect as seamless and as smooth as possible if you transition it with the right amount of protein. Because you're eating a diet that's rich with protein because you're eating a lot of meats. So you need to know how to compensate for that. And the other thing too is meat is rich in B12. So once you go three days without eating meat, you need to replace your B12 intake. That's a key and big mistake that a lot of vegans and vegetarians make. They do not ensure that they have enough intake of B12. And that's why they're faint, they're weak, they're lethargic and things of that nature. If you replace your B12 through supplementation and through the right kinds of foods that has B12, you will be all right. But see, it's just knowing those things and studying to show yourself approval. So again, once every three months for three days, abstain from meat. Because what's going to happen is your body's going to rid itself of inflammation. It's going to be a cancer and disease prevention. And three, it's going to be a natural cleanser and detoxifier for the body. This is Hinos' Sport. Checking out.